Introduction to Agile Software Development Agile software development evolved in order to overcome the limitations that we used to have in the older development methodologies like Waterfall and V-Model. In the year 2001, the group of individuals who were representing the lightweight development methodologies uh, at that time, they came together to see what are the common themes across all those development methodologies. Now, by the end of their meeting, they agreed to the common set of values and principles, and that later, those principles and values later became the Agile Manifesto or Manifesto for Agile Software Development. Now, let's see what are some of the key points of Agile Software Development. Agile Software Development is a lightweight software development methodology. Agile follows two to four weeks iterations or two to four week cycle and after each iteration agile team delivers the working code as compared to the waterfall and v development methodologies wherein the delivery of the code was um, after very long duration like three to six months or sometimes even uh, a year requirements and solutions evolve through collaborative effort so in agile the requirement and solution evolved by the collaborative effort of the whole team as compared to waterfall development methodology wherein there was a dedicated team working on the requirement dedicated team working on the design and then development test so they, they were all different teams um, working on only a specific set of tasks in agile it's it's a collaborative effort within the team and the whole team works towards a common goal to deliver uh, a common goal or common um, uh, set of understanding what each person has within the team uh, so that everyone is on the same page and at the end the product that is delivered is basically what is expected by the stakeholder or by the customer in agile teams are cross-functional now the team in agile is a mix of business people developers, architects, automation testers. So all these people come together and work in a collaborative manner. So cross-functional teams make um, a, an agile team. In agile, there is always a focus on continuous improvement. Since there are two to four weeks iterations, there is a working code um, delivered after each iteration. And then how the team performed within that iteration that is being discussed in the retrospective meeting after that iteration and in that retrospective meeting they discuss what went very well for that particular iteration uh, were they able to deliver the points they discussed uh, or they, they committed uh, was there good collaboration or what improvement could be made so that future iterations are much better as compared to the previous one. So there is a focus on continuous improvement always in agile development. Now the last point is uh, agile encourages rapid response to a change. Since there is a working code or working software showcased after each iteration, now the stakeholders and the team who is um, who is watching the demo or then they are seeing the working code they provide their feedback what is working pretty well and what is you know like as per the expectation if there isn't something which is not as per the expectation those feedback are recorded prioritized and then the team can work on those changes in future iterations so agile encourages rapid response to change as well so these are some of the key points of agile software development methodology